All right, continuing stories and adventures of the Ripping Rattlers. Well, it's north of Dawson Creek, uh, Blue Scoopy, which is eight kilometers out of Dawson Creek, and uh, that's where we're going. We are off up north. Uh, just finished a gig with the Rattlers, uh, did a music fest out in Yak, which was actually because Vinny wasn't available. He's at a birthday party, and Donnie had something to do, so I had to grab Rob Funk and Mike Bennett. So it was uh, old school week. They did a good job, and uh, but it wasn't my guys now, the ones I got now, so it's a little weird. So it's always uh, the loyalty thing. My current band is my current band, but hey, we covered the gig and that. Uh, but really excited. Back to the oil patch, and this time it will not be building roads or uh, working as a swamper. I will be playing music. And it's at the Hart Hotel in Pooscoopy. Uh, Chandra and Jerry are the owners. I've known them. Uh, for years, we booked this before. We're having a big, huge biker show and shine, and we're going to be playing that. And who knows? Uh, I know the way it is uh, before when I traveled up north to play music, and a lot of times the other local bars they see you if you're any ways decent, which we are a really, really good, good band, good rock and kick-ass band. Um, next thing you know, you're up there for a month playing gigs, but we'll see how it pans out. Um, if that doesn't happen, but I'm sure it will, because I'm going to be texting the Silverado owner to come over, and I'm, I'm talking to uh, the uh, Alaska Hotel in Dawson Creek today. Um, but if that doesn't pan out, what's happening is next weekend, the weekend after this weekend, uh, we'll be playing 25th and 26th, 24th, 25th. I don't know. I've gotten into trouble before with screwing up these dates. But anyway, it's that weekend around there. It's always Friday and Saturdays. Except while well, I'm up north, it's sometimes six days in a row. But anyway, what I'm saying, the 24th, I think, is uh, Crawford Bay, New Keys Pub. 25th is a private wedding in the cusp. And uh, that may be with Sharon M., the lovely Sharon M. Um, she's got a great set. <laughs> oh, man. I'm not going to go into detail. But anyway, and uh, oh, what else have I been doing? Oh, I've been working, uh, I work as a, I move furniture. Nelson. It's the, the brain dead job. Like you pick stuff up, put it on a truck, take it somewhere. Oh. The only thing is, you know, just be careful when you're going hallways and in doorways so you don't break anything. Um, but it pays really well. But the adventure begins today. I've got to run around and uh, grab a few things, a few supplies. Bag. Um, we're going to be up there for supposedly uh, a few days, but I think I'm going to pack more because I know Silverado comes down and says, hey, could you guys come play at our place for two weeks, six nights a week? We'll give you this amount of money. You're up here already. Well, then we'll probably have to reschedule the other dates. I mean, the wedding. Nothing I can do about that. But that's my update. Remember, um, always drink tequila. Whenever. That's that's my best advice. Yahoo. Yeah,